what's up guys we are back here with another everything's regular video man we out here at the swap land right now checking up on the camaro man seeing what he got done last night i had to go take off and go to an auction so let's go check it out and see what he got done so far man damn this watermelon is loose as a bitch man this whole car was dangerous bro i swear to god nigga. it was the dangerous whole, the power steering shit was all that shit was loose bro Oh my man, he had a whole bunch of. That's crazy. A whole bunch of bullshit going on, man. So man, give him an update, man. You know I went to the auction and stuff. I went to the auction and stuff last night, man. So you look like you did a lot of work when I was gone, man. Yeah, man. You look like you separated the transmission and everything. Got the transmission book took down all the accessories off. Okay. We got our harmonic balancer ready off, snatched off. Uh, now I'm about to just snatch this old motor off. Uh, and then, um, we can get then we got to swap out the rack and pan. Yeah, swapping out the rack and pan. Alternator. Alternator. Brand new water pump. Brand new water pump. And all gaskets fresh. And all new gaskets. So, and of course, we got all that on warranty. So, you know how that go, man. But yeah, we'll be getting this uh, engine bay pressure wash today. Getting that thing a little bit cleaner. Got everything we need now, so. Oh, yeah, that's just supposed to come right off or what? I'm trying to spin the engine. Oh, okay. To get to the, to the next truck we're right about. Oh, okay, yeah. This bitch ain't even speezing. Got a little move. Alrighty, guys, made it back to AutoZone here. Got the uh, old parts off. Got the old parts off. Got the rack and pain. Got the alternator. Got the water pump. Try to get it. So what are we doing, man? No, just leave ten threads. Okay, bet. Common sense. <laughs> oh, so to match up on this for the wheel alignment. Okay, bet. I get you. I get you. I get you. You should be taking shit off and you be Ten threads. Don't even know what they doing. She making sure we got it right. You know? So we got 10 on the driver's side, 15 on the passenger side. Pretty sure this is going to match up. Kind of makes sense. What do you guys think about it? Alrighty. We got our oil. We got our filter. Some brake cleaner. Got some Lucas. They get this thing right. Got the spark plug, spark plug wires. Alrighty, guys, man. We just left AutoZone, man. So just to give you a quick rundown of what we got, we got a brand new rack and pinion. We got a brand new alternator. We got a brand new water pump. We got uh, oil pan, brand new oil pan gaskets. We got brand new spark plug, spark plug wires, oil and stuff for the oil change. Uh, we didn't get transmission fluid. I forgot about that. So we might need to get some transmission fluid, um, but everything everything else is already done and paid for. So now it's just a matter of putting everything back together. I'm actually about to go to the house for a little bit. By the time I come back, everything should be, I guess, lined up. So we'll catch on camera what we can. In the meantime, if you haven't already, please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel, man. I know you guys been waiting on a, a real build, and I guess, this is the closest we're gonna to get to a real build, man. So, hope you guys are, are enjoying it. What's up, guys? Next day here, man. Back at the swap lane, got the Camaro. Let's check out 
what buddy's done while I was gone. Once again, we got the motor and trans on there. So that's a plus. Got the motor and trans all bolted up with the drive shaft. And uh, got the harmonic balancer, water pump, everything on there junk. Oh, and we got the brand new rack and pinion down there. So that's a plus. Damn. Alrighty guys, back at Walmart, man. They seem to have the cheapest automatic transmission for $13.94, which I already got. So let's pay for this. Go uh, get those bushings from O'Reilly's or AutoZone and uh, head back over there and see what's going on. So we gotta get this uh, stabilizer bushing kit. It's only like $7.99, so it's not that bad. And guys, it's freaking pouring down today, dog. It's raining cats and dogs, man. Never rains like this, but every once in a while, you'll get a good blast of rain. Good little blast. Oh man, made it back. Got our bushings and whatnot. Let's see. Oh shit. Then we got all new accessories. Got a brand new all center, as you guys seen yesterday. Got the water, uh, I mean, power steering, water pump. Got all the accessories on, headers, everything. We just got to swap this uh, strut tower out. And then uh, we should be pretty much good to go. So we also changed the valve cover. My boy said he took it off. It wasn't no like engine sludge, nothing like that. Go to the picture, show them the picture. Oh yeah, yeah, I'm gonna show y'all the picture, boom. Yeah, so y'all see that, man? Yeah. Uh, green and gray, man, did a good pick, man. We went, we got this motor from the junkyard, believe it or not. How much we get this motor for, man? Three bills. $300, man. With the warranty. With the warranty. Oh, so, you know, we're going to get the first start up with y'all, man. Hopefully, it's no knocking. I mean, I'm kind of, you know. Oh, I guarantee you no knocking. Oh, man, we're going to see, confident. man. I'm very confident. Yeah, I'm confident. You know, I got some faith, man. I'm, 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 I give this motor a 9 out of 10. All right, man. I, I feel confident now that you say that, man. I feel good, man. That's cool. And, of course, see how we rock it, man. And just like that, guys. It is back in the car. The car is now lowered down, um, just on jack stands, but still lower than it was. Um, we got the screws in there. We got everything in there. We got the uh, motor mounts, all that stuff taken care of before we even put on the car. So now it's just these little bolts you need to tighten up once you get the. Uh, it looks like he already got the uh, wire harness and everything all figured out. Uh, I mean, it's in there. Just got to plug up a few little holes and get all the fluids and stuff together. But yeah, man, that's the Camaro. We'll be getting this thing started probably tomorrow um, or later tonight, rather. But you guys will see it tomorrow, man. So don't worry. Pretty decent Camaro, man. What y'all think about it? We did the motor swapping about... Maybe about a good two days, two, three days, possibly. But, I mean, you know, took a little time. Could have been quicker. But, you know, we was taking our time with it. So, it's a one-man job. But we do have the old 6.0 motor right here. So you guys just see how dirty and burnt out and gunked up. It is, man. This thing was whooped. But... It is a, uh, you know, LS2. I mean, that's what people want, man. But we got the 5.3 in there, so hopefully that should be all we need, man. So, alrighty, guys, it's gonna be a wrap for today's video, man. We got the old motor out, we got the new motor in, we got all the new stuff attached. So hopefully in the next video, man, um, <clears throat> we'll get this thing started for you. I gotta go take back some transmission fluid, the right transmission fluid, because I got that cheap stuff 
that's just not gonna cut it. Hopefully next video, we'll, we will get that first startup with you guys. Tell me how you guys are liking the build so far, man. I know it's running pretty smooth and pretty quick so far, but um, be advised, we did get this motor from the junkyard, so I'm not sure if it's gonna start. I mean, I'm sure it's gonna start, but I hope it's like nothing or no issues with the motor. And as well as the transmission, as you guys know, we uh, backed it off the trailer and drove it on the trailer. So you never know um, how bad the transmission is. Just hoping everything goes as planned and works out in my favor. It is what it is. But if you haven't already, please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Be sure to stay updated with the build, uh, with the Camaro build, man. This thing is moving pretty quick here. We will have this thing started, so be sure to tune in for that. Make sure you check out the auction videos, man. Hopefully we can grab something at the next auction tomorrow. Who knows, but you know, stay tuned for that. In the meantime, I'll catch you guys on the next one, man. Peace.